Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video guys to any of you having a BMW or wheel drive BMW and you wonder which CV axle shaft is bad. Let's say you turn left or right and you hear popping, clicking noise from the suspension. You know, most likely it's a CV axle. You know what the CV axle noise sounds like. If not, we have a video that explains that. How to tell if it's the left or the right one and make sure you stay until the end I'm gonna give you a very helpful advice okay if you need to replace one of those and I'm going to talk about that as we go so make sure you watch until the end before we start guys let me tell you something uh, every single car we get at the shop we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos why we do that simply because our mission here at the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep providing this free information Something else, if you need to buy a new CV axle shaft, parts, tools, anything for your BMW, check out the link in the description of the video below and you can see where you can get yours from for a really good price, quick shipping as well, that's where we get all our tools and parts from. So, let's explain now, okay, how do you know, okay, which drive shaft is bad and which is good. So, I'm going to place this one here now and I'm going to talk about it, guys, because it's very, very confusing and there is so much information on the internet, but... I will share our experience here and what we notice usually at the shop. As you can see, we even took that BMW for timing chain replacement, so you can find all kind of helpful videos on our channel. Also, we'll have a video that explains how to replace front CV axle shaft on BMW with an X drive system as well. So, this is the shaft, guys. Okay. This goes to the front differential. This goes through the front differential. This goes to the wheel. Okay, the wheel side, okay, and the one that's past the front differential, you can see how it can move left, okay, and right, up, down, everywhere, pretty much. Because when you turn your wheels, okay, the shaft needs to uh, turn as well. When the suspension go up and down, okay, it's going to move here and here. Most of the times they get wore out on the outside, uh, uh, on the outside part, okay, right here. You have a mechanism that consists of multiple balls. It's kind of like a bearing that moves. And when it gets wore out, it has a little bit of play in it. That play will start clicking when you start turning, guys, left or right. But how do you tell, guys, okay, how do you tell which one is bad, left or right one? Usually, guys, okay, if you make a left turn, let's say you're turning to the left, okay, you're turning to the left and you hear the clicking, it means that the right CV axle is bad, the outside wheel, guys. And if you're turning to the right and it's clicking, okay, means that the left one is bad so that's how it is most of the times with some minor exceptions here and there if you have a modified suspension lower car sometimes it can affect that but usually guys if you turn left and it pops it's the right cv axle shaft and if you turn right and it pops okay most likely it's uh, it's uh, the left one guys also uh, guys on most bmw those are super easy to replace okay you need to just remove one bolt okay and you don't need to even take the suspension apart to replace that cv axle shaft we have a complete video that will explain that something else if you have a bmw check this channel out electrical car repair life we have information that can save you thousands of dollars on future car repairs guys okay we're going to have uh, electrical components diagnosing components uh, fixing engine light codes airbag codes things like that that sometimes are a chaos guys so hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time